recording. It's Carlos here. Um, and I'm looking at dandelion. And so the reason I'm looking at dandelion, there's probably tons of videos about this here plant, is not um, to go too much into details, but I will reiterate, it's really a dynamic plant and it's very good. And this might be chicory. Chicory and dandelion, as far as I know, almost do the exact same things, both to the land and improvement and being dynamic accumulators. And they um, both are good for our digestive system. Basically, especially um, right before right before we eat. But basically, the dynamic, uh, the dilemma is, is that I want to eat this and just rip it off and put it in my mouth. Um, but look where it's growing. It's growing next to a Walgreens, and oftentimes the landscapers they hire just automatically use um, pesticides. Now that the dandelion is growing here, sorta of indicates that they haven't used pesticide, but maybe they recently have, or the dandelion is the quote unquote enemy and they're trying to get rid of it. So either way, it presents a dilemma to nomadic people uh, such as I am right now, and nomadic people in general who don't know what's been sprayed here before, whereas a local person would, but probably wouldn't even care to look at the dandelion. But to me, this is a real source of food, but it ends up being like I'm in a place where it's, um, where it's like a disease is prevalent and I have to watch out for the disease. The disease being uh, pesticides and herbicides that are going to affect the food I eat and whether or not I survive well that day and how long I survive if, uh, if you take it on accumulation. It's a very serious thing, even though it's just coming down to one dandelion um, and you can say, oh, just go buy your food at the store. I'd like to forage. I'd like to do what my ancestors have done for a long time. And I'd like to do it without uh, being um, stuck on a specific territory. It's sort of what my animal insides are telling me. And I don't want to say it's my right because then we could all start talking about our rights and they could come into conflict. But um, I do feel that I should be able to move around and um, have access to food, I guess. But I don't know, that that comes into contradiction a lot with property, the idea of property. So, um, yeah, I don't know. There's some other thoughts I have that this could really spin into a lot of different discussions. I definitely have some thoughts on trespassing, something that happened recently that triggered an uh, idea about trespassing that maybe I'll make into another video. But anyways, thank you for watching. This is Carlos reporting from the, the front lines, dandelion on a sidewalk, but it's in the domain of a Walgreens. So do I eat it or not? Ah, I don't know. I think I'm going to not eat it, even though I probably could get away and be fine with eating it. Um, just because it's kind of a wimpy dandelion. So uh, it's not going to be as super loaded as something really good. And I'm not yet to my eating destination, so there might be something better waiting down the road. Um, all right, yeah, that's it. Thanks for watching. I babbled a lot. I hope you like babbling.